Hi guys, this is William and welcome to video 6 where we will be looking at combined conditions. So really the end aim of, of this and the following videos are to have you pick up a key object and use it on the door. This door will then be opened so that we can move into a different screen. Now to do this we need to first set our inventory object to be usable on other objects. So remember we picked up our object, it gets added to our inventory, but then from there we need to now say how that inventory object will be used on objects in the world. Now what we will do in this exercise is we will use the classic style where we use the currently selected inventory item with a conjunction word. So when I pick up the key and it's added into my inventory and I use the key, then my text will say use key with, which is my conjunction word, door, right? Use key with door. Now, as per usual, you have the exercise files that you can follow. But now to do this, the first thing is go to your interfaces, right? And make sure you can open the combined conditions scene file. So open your interfaces. Choose your cycle icon interface and then choose use. Now on the command properties, we have different command types. We have normal command, we have com combined command and give command. Now the normal command, that's the default. And with this command, you can execute an action on a scene object or an inventory item. The combined command is what we will use in this instance. Now, with this command, I'm just going to select it here. With this command, you can execute an action on a scene object or an inventory item, as well as combine an item with a scene object or another item. Now, when I choose this, you'll see that I have the conjunction word field that opens up. And here, I'm just going to type in with. So that's going to be my conjunction word. Use key with door. The last command here is the give and this is similar to the combined command, except this is when you use multiple playable characters and you have an inventory system and you you uh, interact with another character and this item is then automatically transferred to that character. So now that we've chosen combined command and the width, now our, our conjunction part is set up. And in the documentation, you can see how this will look. Use key with door, right? But now we're not done yet. We now need to set the action part on the destination object. So in this instance, it's the door. So what we will do is we will go to our scene and we will choose hallway one and we'll choose the door and then go to our actions. Now note, we already have a use action here. The door is locked. I can't open it. We will now add another action. And this will be when we use the key on the door. So we'll put our command to use. And then here, item, we say key. All right. So what will happen is, what will happen when we use the key with the door? So for now, for this exercise, all we're going to do is we're going to have text be displayed. So I am going to just add a new action part. Use my search area to say display text and then say key is used on door, All right? So now if we play our scene and we use the key on the door, then the message should appear. Let's take a look. So I walk down, I grab my key, I then use my key and notice I used my key and look at my sentence here above, use key with what? Use key with fish tank, use key with door. And I'm going to click that. Ah, key is used on door. Perfect. So that's that's exactly what we want. And this is the com combined command. So what we'll do later as well is we'll do the actual drop. So when you pick up a key, like this, then when you use it, your icon will actually turn into a key. Uh, and But that will be covered a bit later. Alright guys, uh, see you in the next video.